Good evening, State College. I'm student meteorologist Joe Spear here with the Penn State Campus Weather Service giving you an outlook on what the severe weather is looking like here in Pennsylvania and how it's going to unfold as we head into tonight and tomorrow. Here across much of central Pennsylvania and the eastern part of the state, we're seeing a wide swath of different kind of alerts and weather systems going out here. We're seeing anything from flooding to tornadoes and a lot of wind advisories as well. We're going to focus in on what the tornado situation is looking like. It's concentrated mostly in the central part of Pennsylvania. It's going to be issued until f midnight here for tonight and it's ranging into the south part of the northeast as well and that's associated with what the storm prediction center thinks is going to be a five percent chance of touchdown in terms of tornado formation it's ranging at two percent here in the northern part of the state even a little bit of ten percent down in parts of southern pa now the big story is the cold front that's been moving across the state that's been giving us a lot of this severe weather here's the outlook for that much of the southern part of pennsylvania and the eastern part has an enhanced risk of seeing severe weather here in State College in Center County. We're only at a slight risk, but that's still two out of five. So it's something to keep an eye out for in terms of any alerts that might be issued in your area. Now with this cold front, we're seeing a lot of strong winds here at 28 miles per hour in Erie, 15 in Franklin, 18 in Pittsburgh, 12 here in State College. But the winds are gonna pick up as that front continues to progress across our area. It's currently sitting here a little bit into central Pennsylvania, mainly sitted off towards the west. We aren't seeing any intense showers now, but we are seeing a little bit of rain. But progressing into today, it should move by by 7 p.m. Here's 10 p.m. where the situation is going to look like. The front's mainly concentrated in the eastern part of the state. Temperatures are starting to drop, and as we progress into Friday morning, a lot of the eastern part of Pennsylvania is going to be experiencing some high winds, but relatively clear skies. The west part of Pennsylvania still seeing a little bit of clouds but progressing into Friday evening the skies start to clear out a little bit but the winds still continue to pick up and the temperatures continue to drop we're going to drop it hour by hour here for you 6 p.m. we're looking at some strong showers as that front starts to approach 68 degrees for our temperature and in just two hours later we're seeing temperatures drop by 10 degrees the showers are going to continue to linger as that front has just moved by and we're going to still see some cloudy and windy conditions but the temperatures are going to continue to drop here at 50 degrees now for tomorrow the situation starts to continue in terms of what we've been seeing today 42 degrees for our high remaining mostly cloudy the sun continues to pick up a little bit into the later parts of the day but it's not enough to warm us up and it's going to stay windy we're going to see winds out of the west at 10 to 20 miles per hour we could see gusts as high as 36 so be sure to prepare for that you're going to want to continue to follow us here at the penn state campus for the service on facebook and twitter to get more updates on how the weather unfolds